All right, y'all. Guess what? We back. Now, I told y'all. You was on the call in early. Y'all been holding that, Jack. I'm elegant now. You know, I got my... And especially like I'm a screwball now, you know, I ain't I was no more. I can sit back and relax. Uh, all right, now if y'all was on the little call in, I told y'all. I said when I get home, I said when I get home, I'm gonna watch this race. I said I'm gonna watch this race when I get there so I can see, right? Before I watch the race. I said, let me just go, let me go dip it down and check in places, you know, like uh, Facebook and Twitter. I don't want to see what other people were saying. I don't want to see what other people were saying about, about 10 I haven't seen the race yet. I haven't seen the race yet. But then I noticed something. I knew it was coming. I knew it was coming. I mean, maybe it's just because, I don't know, it's been, a, I don't know, I don't know, but we knew it was coming. You knew somebody was going to bring the elephant in the room, like, is it really possible? So I'm over there, I'm over there in a whole nother little, you know, I'm over there in a whole nother little uh, people chat stuff, whatever, I'm looking, I'm reading, and they already start talking about it, they like, bro, that ain't possible. I'm, I'm still here reading, I ain't saying nothing, I'm just looking, they like, that's a lot of 10 sixes. <laughs> Not that it's, it's, it's a 10 six. It's like, that's a lot of 10 sixes. We're about to find out. Let's watch this together. And I'm going to get back to what they were talking about. Oh, first of all, first of all, don't, this is not for y'all, okay? So don't worry about why my TV is so small. I got my little setup over here. This is my little office. You know, when I be home sometimes, I be trying to do work and stuff. So this ain't for y'all to watch. Don't be making fun of my little bit of TV over here. Y'all watch it on the big TV. Now, I let you watch it here. Damn it. Like to talk about this. Let me see. I don't want to hear. I don't want to hear. I don't want to hear because I hear like trying to play it. So I'm going to turn that down. Turn that down. Oh, yeah. MJ. So MJ, MJ caught a little crimp. When she was warming up, I know y'all had asked me earlier on the show today. Y'all asked me earlier. I was like, "What? What happened to Melissa Jefferson? She was warming up. She found a little thing, and then coach pulled out. Smart. She's done with it. All right, back to the show. Shh, got the fire. Let me fast forward. Can I fast forward? Oh shit, my fast forward too fast. Get to get pad race. Okay, let's get. It. All right, let me see what's going on. Let me see what's going on. Here. Let me see this. <laughs> get it blocked, man. Don't get it blocked. Not there. Get it blocked. Come on, man. Don't try to watch the race. Come on, man. Not there. Get it blocked. Come on, man. Then hurry that. Nine damn. Now, Okay. So there we go. Damn. I'm gonna watch it in real time here. I forgot y'all were even here, but I remember y'all was here. But hold on, hold on. We gonna talk about this. We gonna talk about this. Hold on. I 
right now, I said I was going to do a breakdown. I'm going to do a breakdown. After this, I'm going to go to Instagram and do a breakdown. You know what? I don't even think I need to do a breakdown. I don't think I need to do a breakdown. I'm going to be honest with y'all. Okay, so first of all, let's address the top, the title. The title. Like I was saying, people over there in the chat was talking about well, on the Facebook world. Was like, they just an elephant in the room. They got right talking about, all right, is it real or is she on something? I'm going to go sit with them. Go look at it for yourself. You know how the folks in the Facebook says cool talk? You know how they talk over there. Go look for yourself. The folks is over there right now. Like, man, I don't know if that's real. I think she might be on something. Go look at the Facebook. See, y'all not believe me. Go look at the Facebook says cool. But anyway, so I was like, you know what? I have to be the person to address the elephant in the room because that's what race take is all for. Like race take is to address the elephant in the room and give my, you know, my honest opinion. That's what I do. I get my honest opinions. Or, or to, to an extent of how I can. Okay, I can not. With that being said, I got to be honest with y'all. Almost everything, and I'm speaking to y'all from, from, from Ray, Common Sense. I'm not going to play with y'all. That's why I already had a couple shots before I came on here. I said, I got to go live. I got to go real on this topic. Almost everything I've seen, and I'm being honest with y'all, a lot of it came out to be whatever. Almost every, a lot of stuff, not everything, not everything, but a lot of stuff I've seen and tried to feel. Don't be looking like they can do what they said they just did. So I'm like, oh, God, what it is. And that's about, for me, boy, that's about 99% of the stuff. Mm, I don't think they can do that for real. I, like, that's, just, that's just me. That's just me. Now, I have my reasons because I would look at, I look at the enemy, I look at what they're doing, right? Which what y'all know, which is what y'all mean do, which is break the race down. So I look at everything from a training standpoint, and I look at the mechanics of the body. I look at what they're doing, and then I, I study them based on like their season. I study that. I, I, I can sit there and do that. Now I gotta be honest with y'all. If you show me anything from Marion Jones, <laughs> I love MJ. Well, that the original MJ. You show me anything with Marion Jones. I go back and watch anything which I've done. I can see. No. That's not natural. <laughs> like, I, I, I know what to look for. Like, I can, mm -mm, you can't do that. that. That and that can only happen if that is that. I'm just saying. I know all this shit. I'm just telling I do. I told you I knew I had me. I had about four shots before I even turned this thing on. And I was like, I got to go ahead and flip over it. Well, I, I'm finna get ready to go out too. So I was like, <laughs> but anyway, I'm going to say it like this here. It's been a lot of questionable stuff in track and field. And this right here is probably. One of the most remarkable things we've seen in track and field. Well, I mean, to me, it's like 10-6. Uh, what? 10-6. Uh, what? 10-6. 10-6. 10-6. 10-6. Oh, what? Like, what? 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 Oh, okay. Cool. So you're going to open up with 10-6. Yep. You're going to hit 10-6 at the World Championship. Yep. You're going to hit 10-6 some more at the World Championship. Yep. Wait. Come on. Talk to me now. Talk to me. Talk to me. Help me. Please help me. Please help me. Because I don't want to do this. So you go open up with 10 6. Yep. You go hit 10 6 in the middle where people say we you peek it. Yep. And you're gonna hit 10 6 on this side too. Yep. So you're not gonna do this and this? Nope. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? So you're gonna go straight right here? Yep. Okay, I say all right. So now they had me thinking about it. So that's what I really got taking my shots. And started looking at me. And I had to go over and look at her, look, go back to her resume. Like, how long have I been doing it? Damn, okay. But then, for the first time, for the first time ever, I found an escape goal to where it's like, no, nah, that's possible. <laughs> like, I'm, damn it, whatever, I'll just call it what it is. Like, I'll say it again. 
About 99% of the stuff that I've been in in track and field, and a lot of the shit don't came out that they were taking stuff. Y'all got more of them. Both stuff that I've been and even if, again, going back to Marion, to go, it don't matter. I look at it, I'll be like, that ain't right. No, 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 not just from a track athlete standpoint, but I, degrees. Hello, gym. Hello, personal training. Hello, people pay me to, to, to work on their bodies. Hello, I had a doctor in my gym. I know what to look for. I'll be honest with y'all. What Shannon doing is very, very, very should be done. <laughs> and that's the crazy part about it. You know what? You know what's so crazy about what track and field has what, what has happened to track and field? And I'm be wondering with y'all. What's happened to track and field is that people have messed it up for so long and messed it up so much to well, the actual reality don't look like reality right now. That's what it's supposed to be. You're not supposed to break, you're not supposed to do this. You're not supposed to do this and then do this. You're not, you're supposed to do this. <laughs> like what she's doing is very possible. Like that to me lets me know, like, oh no, nah, this is 100 percent her. 1000 percent her. Why? Okay, I'll tell you why. If it wasn't 1000 percent her, that 10 six that she opened up with would have turned to a world record came Oregon. It did not. 10 six again. Okay. All right. Now, what she hit? Okay, well, if it was she owned something. 10 six again? Oh shit. Okay. So where you drop it? Because every person that's ever really, you know, like been caught on anything, drop, <laughs> drop, and she ain't drop. <laughs> she, from a personal trainer standpoint, and I know a lot of y'all personal trainers and stuff like that, and some of y'all even doctors, so you understand what I'm about to say. From a personal trainer standpoint, what she's doing is what the body's supposed to do. It ain't supposed to break. It really don't. Why? You just gotta take care of it. <laughs> like that's all you gotta do. It's not that hard. It's really not that hard. What she is showcasing is literally from a trainer standpoint, bro. I've been trying to tell these fools with that shit forever. <laughs> like, yo, like ain't no such thing no up and down. Like, bro, if you train in the right way and you eating right, you doing everything right. Your body don't go up and down. <laughs> it's, it's, it's right here. Like it's consistent. Why? Because it's been built up. <laughs> like it, it don't go up and down. It don't do, do, no, it, it does this when you don't build it up right. So the fact that she keeps hitting 10 sixes, that is more legitimate than anything. It's like, no, 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 Jack, you keep eating the same thing. That just mean you don't got to go and build your body up. <laughs> like that, all that is is like she pretty much saying. All that bull crap y'all put in y'all system, I don't put it in my system. <laughs> That's pretty much what she's saying. She pretty much saying, when y'all out there doing whatever else, party, I'm at home with my child being a mama, and when I'm not being a mama, I'm in the weight room or whatever. Like, like she literally, she showed what the body's supposed to do. That's why I saw it. Like, I'm looking at it like, hey, well, I entertain y'all thoughts. I got to entertain y'all thoughts. That's what I do. I got to entertain it. I'm looking. No, <laughs> no. Now, and here's, here's the number one thing I'm looking at. It would be different if you watch her race. Go watch all her races. Watch all of them. Watch all her races. She's not doing it off of power. That'd be your first day at giveaway. I'm telling you right now. If you want to know if somebody owns something, that first day at giveaway, Jack, going to be their power. I'm just going to put that out there like that. <laughs> and that's going to be first thing. She's not doing it off of power. Although she's giving like the looks, that it's, but it's not power. Trust me, it's not power. She's doing this off of her arms. That's the difference. Like at, when I'm looking at this shit right here, especially in slow motion, when I'm looking at this slow motion and I'm looking at all of her races, I'm looking for what is the difference? What is she doing that they're not doing? And that's any breakdown I do. I'm looking for, okay, well, what is this person doing that they keep winning so much to uh, address the field ain't doing? That's how I got something I'm smart because both kept beating me up. And I was like, well, what this nigga doing? I ain't doing it. I'm still studying. So if you look at all her races, the one thing she does better than everybody across the field is she breaks her arms. What do coaches around the world try and say? What are y'all trying to say? Who get the signal first? <laughs> Who get the signal first? The hands, the arms get the signal first, and then the feet get the signal. The difference is, I ain't got to explain, I ain't got to break down y'all. Go look at it. Go look at it. <laughs> That's all I can tell y'all. Just go look at it. Go back and watch all our races and watch the watch her arms versus everybody else on the line. 
that's the difference. Like she, I don't know if she took boxing. <laughs> I don't know what she did. Like, I don't know if she went and did some kung fu and started IT man. I don't know what she did. <laughs> but if you go watch her arms, her arms are do like it, she beat, she doing what I tell track athletes I train all the time. Beat that damn drum. <laughs> like beat the drum. Beat the drum. Beat the drum. Hey, move your hands. Go. Move your hands. That's how, that's I'm seeing, I'm seeing a person who has taken care of their body, and I'm seeing a person who is beating the drum. Now, the only reason why I'm saying is because she's staying consistent. Now, am I saying that the people who was like consistently fast and all of a sudden, oh, hi, y'all, world record? Yeah. But I'm just saying, she's not on that fast. She's not on that fast. I told y'all I could read the Wait. Which one is this? Oh, okay. Um, what was I saying that? Yeah, that's all it is. That, that's why I was like, I knew it was going to happen. Like, it, it, it was destined to happen. It had to happen. Like, we can't, you can't have nobody going consistent 10 sixes and people not think that they own something. Y'all know that shit's going to pop up. So as soon as it popped up, I was like, all right, well, shit, I guess I'll go on and address it now. I'm gonna tell you now. I'm gonna tell you now, Jack. What is it? What? What that? I love all my friends. I don't know what the hell Wallace talking about though. <laughs> right about what? What was you writing about? Hold on. What? 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 Uh -uh. <laughs> what? What you mean? Track family, man, I tell you. But anyway, yeah, that's all I'm saying. Hell, I, I'm, I, boy, listen, look at her. Everything she's doing is possible. I'm going to tell y'all why. Y'all know I like to try and, you know, throw myself in the mix some type of way. So the year was 2013. Right? The year was 2013. It's a true story. Stay with me. It's story time. I told you I mean, had a little. 2013. Ray was training, you know, SMU, learning some stuff from them. I'm going to fast forward this story to 2014. Ray was went to Team Nigeria. He ran 10 10. You know, 10-10 in like June. He went to Commonwealth Games. Didn't really do too hot Commonwealth Games. The, the, the weather went, went nice to me. But then I ended the season that year. 2014, you can go look it up. 2014, I ended the season with 10-09 legal at the African Championships. And I did that 10-09 at the African Championships in, um, it was late August, right? Now, I guess you're probably wondering why I'm telling this story. Here's what I'm telling you the story. I know for a fact the body can go that long sprinting because I was doing data on myself. I start, and I have videos of this, as always, and you check out my Instagram. I started sprinting in September because I wanted to run fast indoor, which I did. I started literally sprinting in September. And I was able to sprint from September into August, and my body never fell apart. I remember in August, I told Mark just, I was like, Mark, I learned a whole lot this year based on what how I was training in my nutrition because I didn't bullshit my body at all. I was like, this, no, this never, uh -uh, nothing. I said, Mark, it's August and I just went 10.09. I said, bro, I've been sprinting since September and I haven't pulled anything. I ain't tore nothing. And I was like, and um, well, I think I was like 30, 33 then. And I was like, and I'm 33 years old. But the difference was at 33, going to my math, right? Yeah, at 33, the difference was I was just a tad bit smarter up here. So I took care of my body. Like I didn't trash my body at all. Like I literally did not trash my body. I sprinted fast. And I mean fast from September to August and never fell apart. So what she doing, I know for a fact, like now, now, because I've tested that theory. And also, I know for a fact from the people I know, you can do that. 
but you can't slack with your you can't slack with your body. You gotta treat your body like a Bugatti. And what I see from her, treat your whole body like a Bugatti. Because of that, that's what you're supposed to get. 10, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16. Take it or love it. Whatever you want. Take it or leave it. How they call it. The lady is amazing. The lady is about to be the greatest of all time. And I think, you know, I'm just going to call it what it is when I was over there in the cesspool called Facebook. I think it was, I don't want to sound like that, though, but it was one of y'all Americans, man. Y'all need to start doing that, man. Jeff McCoy, look at him. Jeff, y'all, y'all need to start doing that. Now, I know, I know how y'all feel. How, I feel the same way about Jan Rock, but y'all need to start doing that. These folks start doing some stuff, and then what y'all start getting afraid of, y'all start questioning it. Anytime somebody start getting close to knocking off a flojo or getting close to saying, you know, the next dope, that when y'all Americans want to be like, I don't trust her. I don't know. I think she might have been. Nah, I'll leave it alone. <laughs> Just leave it alone. Enjoy the show. Ride it out. Ride it out. Let it go. Hey, she ain't, let it go. She ain't doing shit. It is what it is. It is what it is. Y'all know me. Y'all know I'll be the first. I'll be the first to be like, I ain't gonna say nothing, but y'all know I get my little telltale symbol. You know, I I'll be you y'all know I got my signs. I'll be like, but you know, I ain't, ain't nothing. But man, I ain't got nothing to say about that lady, man. <laughs> it is moving right now. And do it in the best way possible. Yeah, 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 but I got to go there, and that's my dog, too, love of the devil. But I knew it. I knew something went right when I saw my girl blessing hit her. Ten, and I was like, mm-mm, Jack. <laughs> I was like, you see how strong she, you see how she, what, mm-mm, Jack. And lo and behold, what happened? So it's like, it's, it's a different, it just, you just, it's different stuff to look for. And you they be like, mm-mm. <laughs> hey, shout out to my boy Dwayne Chambers. You know, we world championship next to each other. <laughs> I felt some type of way after that, man. Like, man, this one don't got me call, man. But same thing with him when he came out and <laughs> I said, ooh, ooh, that's a lot of power. <laughs> hey. That ain't no speed. That's a lot of power, Jack. That's a lot of power. How you get that much power? <laughs> Just saying, like, I live in the gym. I literally live in the gym. That's why I be like, man, <laughs> your body ain't, you know. But again, for her, I was going now. For her, oh, yeah, 100%, 130% over. 150,000, 30% over. 150,000 because she keeps doing it. <laughs> she keeps doing it over and over again. She's not having a bad day. All right. She ain't having a bad day. No, no. Tan Apollo. Let me watch it one more time. My gosh, y'all here. Yeah. One more time. Talk down. See? Shereka, what it do, man? I forgot Shereka was even in the race. See, when Shereka get in hundreds, you just you forget she even in sometimes. <laughs> well, I can't see. I see my name. Wait, hold on. I missed that comment. I don't know what you meant by Noah. Like, I'm confused. What? 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 I'm confused. What? What do you mean? That didn't make sense to me. I don't. I don't know. If you, I don't know what you're asking me. I don't know what you're asking me. So retype that comment and ask it again because I don't want to scroll back up. But yeah, I don't understand. That. Oh, if you case you're wondering, I don't have the volume on because I don't want my video to get flagged. Apparently, no matter what I do, <laughs> if I, I break one YouTube rule, they and <clears throat> bit of bean. Oh, five, three. What's going on, baby? All right, here we go again. Shout out to my dog, MJ. Caught that little crap, pulled it out. I'm all good. 
Oh, no, we got to wait for the help and get in the block. She's going to take 20 minutes to get in the block. <laughs> Tulu didn't look that bad, though. Tulu didn't look that bad. Wait, Noah Brad's past times consistently 1970, 1980, 1996, 1993, 1904. I'm confused. What are you talking about with Noah, though? Hold that thought. Let me get that over here. <laughs> Man, look, she just put her arms. Wait. Look how fast she put her arms. And then, if you just look, So it's not a real breakdown. That's what we're doing a breakdown. I'll go and do a real breakdown on the big TV, but I just got, I just have to show y'all this, even though you can't see it. The, if I'm just looking at her versus a meal, her core don't move. Like if you just want to do my fear, do my dogs. When she's running, this shit here ain't ain't bullet. What's up? It won't just that bad. It's so much. It's so much. It's so much stuff that y'all don't be knowing. I'll be looking at. It's the tiny details. Do this shit forty-five times and see how slow you run. That don't do that shit forty-five times and stay right here and see how fast you run. <laughs> oh, man. Like, and then even right, if you just look at the loop right now, you look at the loop, man. Oh, 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 oh. Knee kick back. No disrespect, just me. Elbow out here. If you look at it, yeah, her whole torso twisted. Like, come on. <laughs> right here. Sway back. No sway back. Uh, it's the perfect thing that I can do this year. <laughs> like, no, you have a sway back. CT, sway back. No. Man, come on. Y'all just stop playing that lady. <laughs> That's the best bitch y'all gonna see. Man, that lady flawless. That lady flawless. Y'all just better stop playing that lady, man. She. <sighs> All the way through that thing. All the way through that thing. Killing. Killing. Her arms out of the whole dog. Her arms. See, this is what Shelly is doing. Shelly is proving. Shelly is proving a lot of the stuff that I was saying too. Damn it. What they did. <laughs> Go back here. Boy, you better stop doing that. <laughs> you know. You don't waste the time. What did I tell you? Get big arms. <laughs> Boy, you better stop doing that, man. Shit. Bye. <laughs> I ain't got time to play with y'all. I don't know all these extra big arms, big arms lying. Then trying to break that up. That's it. Like, when she coming out the hole, when she coming out the block, she coming out. Move, like, arms just firing. Like, here, she beating the drum from the start. Everybody else waiting too late. They trying to beat the drum when you get to 45 feet. You trying to build up, build up. Not, nah, man. You made us start beating the drum at meter one. She's gone. Ain't nothing you can do about it. 
Watch the audience. Oh, y'all can't even see it. Dang it. My bad. I can't get that. Shit. But anyway. Oh, 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 Hey, at that point, shit ain't shit you can do about it. There ain't nothing you can do about it. Ain't nothing you can do about it. What she doing is what I tell all the football players I train for their boarders and anybody I train. That's how I tell them, hey, when you come off that line, damn that bitch or whatever this shit means, man, don't be, no, do not do that. Do, do, do this shit dead in the water. Your first motion is punch, punch. Top, top. It's punch, punch. Like, we don't have time to be back. Man, that lady gone. Man, I'm getting out of free course and everything, man. I ain't playing even. Dude, look at that. I was there. I was there. Arms. 90, 90, 90. Look, look, look. This is why. You can't see what you just watch. And you can watch her arm versus the little Hobbs arms. Just watch the arm difference. I'm sitting here telling you. Aaliyah is going way back here with her hand. Frank is stopping right here. <laughs> like it's here. Clock, clock, clock. You get it. I'm going to claw your ass out of the track. That extra, all it takes is that extra oomph. What y'all don't understand is that extra oomph, that's 52 times. You just went an extra oomph 52 times. Why? Because it's roughly 52 steps in that 100 meters. So your extra oomph. 52 times just costed you about 0.52. Get what she just did. She cut that extra oomph off and put that bitch that way. She ain't no waste of motion. I'm showing you all that she's doing. She gone. Go. While you're back here, ah, uh, too late. <laughs> she ain't nothing to do about it. Ain't nothing to do about it. Ain't nothing you can do about it. She's sitting, I'm teaching her, showing y'all. Stop. <clears throat> oh, it's over with. <laughs> It's over with. It's over with. Don't do it. Don't do it. Damn, I love watching the whole program, right? I should not have been drinking. Well, that's how I do best shows like this. Or whatever, like what I have to talk about. Man! All right, y'all. So check it. That was amazing. About as amazing as screwball. That gets screwed. But the liquor kind. I mean, I'm never going to get proper sponsors. I just don't know how to do that stuff. Hmm. Anyway, shout out to here. I'm going to go, though. I'm going to go. Hold on. I'm going to put my shoes on, too. Because I didn't come here to talk to y'all. I just came here to address that little situation that somebody was talking about. <laughs> just came here to address that little situation. That's all. You see, I ain't even set up. I ain't even got the microphone that like that. So, you know, they want to talk about that. But anyway, so the elephant in the room. It's no longer the elephant in the room. I shot the elephant. Well, no, I didn't really shoot the elephant. But I'm just saying, you know how figure speech. There's no elephant in the room. There's no elephant in the room. There's no, no, no. Erase all of everything. What do you think? Ray, are you concerned Jamaica will get one, two, three next world in the Olympics? First of all, concerned to be rooted. I don't know how you meant that. Um, I so I don't know how to answer that. I don't. I, I really don't know how to answer that. I don't, I don't know what you mean by concerned. Like, am I concerned? Like, like because I'm American, I answer like that. Then um, I don't see them going one, two, three at the next World Championships. I don't. I I see that. I see it finally getting broken up. I don't see one, two, three at the next world championship. I'll explain that later on down the line, but I don't see one, two, three at all whatsoever. And I can tell you who's going to break up that one, two, three. But no, I don't see it. I don't see it. What do we, what I think of Flojo's form? Flojo had a lot of power. <laughs> That's all I can say, man. Like, Flojo, Flojo had a lot of power, boy. Flojo ran with a lot of, Flojo ran with a lot of power. She was a very powerful runner. That's how I look at Flojo's running. 
I mean, if you stayed around for the whole show, you probably caught that. <laughs> well, I'm in trouble. <laughs> Come pull up, cause I'm in trouble. <laughs> Ah. Eat up. What's going on, brother? Maribel, what do you mean what happened to Maribel? Maribel is a, a, a athlete who had one amazing season. Maribel went from who are you to where are you? Meaning, why aren't you in this big race? Why aren't you in that big race? Maribel had the greatest season. Maribel had a, had a season that we all wish we could have had. Like, you're a nobody and you became a somebody. It's just that we're in the, the world of track and field. Well, well, shit, if you become a somebody, you better goddamn do something or we're going to look at you like a nobody. But when you think about it, it's like what she did this year, come out of nowhere, nobody to get that far. It's great. So guess what? At the Memphis. Mm -mm. It's time to shut it down. I couldn't agree more, Ray. OK, love you too. Bye bye. What you talking about? That, that was So that thing now, man. Shoot. Awesome season. Awesome. Anytime, let me clear this up. Anytime you can get a damn medal, ain't nothing about know what happened to like, bro. I got I, I, I got a medal indoors. Like nothing happened. It was great. <laughs> like, hey, you know, so. First year out here, I got a medal. She's fine. Uh, only Dina stands a chance. I'm not trying to talk about. Eco job, she will. I mean, she's already gotten offers already. You know, so just put it like that. She's already gotten offers, so she's going to have a contract at this point right now. Is I would say more of taking the right deal, but no, she's straight. She's straight. She'll be right. Next year's going to be their real year, so she'll be fine. Trust me, she'll be fine. <sighs> hmm. Dina coming for everyone in what? Can Dina run 10-7 low? Yes. 100% Dino can definitely run 10 7 low. That's about it. I go 72, 72 to 75. No faster than that. Tico Jock, get the time, brother. Just Blaze. Let's just take out the first part, man. Just take out the first part and ask the question. <laughs> Still trying to keep it somewhat respectable. I'm glad you said that. Dina is what? Injury prone. So what does that mean? What do we learn today, class? Nutrition. Drink. Just leave it at that. Which one you want me taking to do what? All right. Will it take a sub 10.7 to medal next year? No, not at all. <clears throat> a sub 10.70? Mm-mm. Mm-mm. No. Uh -uh. See, this is what y'all not going to do. <laughs> this, 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 right here, this right here is what y'all not going to do. Y'all not going to get Shelly Ann struck. And get comfortable with these 10-6s and think everybody gonna start doing them. You're not. It's, it's what they say about LeBron James. Cherish him now. Because when he's gone, <laughs> it ain't gonna be the same. Don't get used to this. Uh -uh, uh -uh, nope. <laughs> no. It ain't gonna be no 10-6. Nah, uh -uh. Not at all. Uh -uh. Nah. I would say winner 10-6 possibly. Definitely that. But everybody 10-6 the medal? No. Not at all. Yeah, definitely 10-6 the metal, but everybody else would be cool without it. I mean, Shelly, nothing Shelly did would fool me right now. 
It wouldn't at this point. I mean, unless you go really do something stupid like running 1041. Hmm. What do I think of Glenn shutting down Oblique? Um, I answer it two ways. If Oblique was getting appearance fees, I'm not shutting you down. Sorry, go get you been to get this money. All right. If Oblique was not getting appearance fees, shut them down. Shit, for what? Man, since you keep running, bro, they get they shut it down now and then get ready for next year so we can get to the point where we get these appearance fees. <laughs> hey, that's all about it's all about that money, man. Hey, shut it down. You make no money, shut down. How fast do it does the lane go in 2024 when it's Olympic time? 2024 is too far away to make that prediction. If the Olympics was, say, next year, well, let me think about it. Elena go 10-4 in 2024. I didn't mean to make it rhyme like that, but I had to think about everything. Elaine will go 10-4 in 2024. So the world record has not been broken by the end. Elaine Thompson will break the world record in 2024. I guess like market, Ohio, they say, keep it market, calendar it. Yeah. Provide no injuries, nothing like that. Elaine Thompson in 2024 will break the world record. I, I, can, I, can, I can break it down to y'all. It'll take me a whole 20 minutes to explain to you how and why. But yeah, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, because her bodies are, she's the only person that's ever came close to it. Think about that. She's the only, Shelly shows a string of sixes. That's pretty. That's beautiful. Elaine's the only person that's came close to it and hit that 10-5. <laughs> Y'all got to understand, Elaine switched coaches this year. That's going to be a changeover year. You're not going to get the best out of athlete because the program is going to be a little different. You're going to get about a good 70 to 75% of that athlete. So what y'all seen this year was nothing but a normal coaching changeover, which is the crazy part. So by next year, her body going to be adjusted to the new system. So next year, you're going to see it in faster lane. And then by that third year, when it clicks, She's going to go back and find that 10 5 lane with that new training lane, and it's a wrap, Jack. <laughs> I'm telling you not. It's over with. And you can't argue with it because why? Shelly Ann at that age is saying 10 6 is possible. So, what Shelly Ann is doing, Shelly Ann is pushing the envelope of speed for age. You can no longer say you 32. No, nope, don't want to hit. <laughs> you can no longer say, no, mm -mm. until you hit that age range. You still got time to hit, hit whatever number you want to hit. So I actually see it. 2024, that's two records. I, that's two people that they're going to convince me of two records. I'm convinced that no one allows can break the 200 meter world record in 2024. And I'm also convinced that Elaine Thompson can break the world record in the in 2024. She's the only person that's, that can come close to getting it, y'all. I'm just being honest. She's the only person. She's the only person that can come close to getting it. Be on the way. Hey, it looks like my niece is online. If y'all see Denise Edwards in the comments and it's like all those letters, F, G, B, B, yeah, that's one of my nieces or nephews that's doing the comments. That's not actually my mom. She doesn't have dyslexia. One of my nieces and nephews are watching on her phone. Hey, Israel. Try not Israel. It's probably Naraya. Naraya, go do your grandma on the phone. Stop texting. It's either Naraya. She's in the right. It's been right a hundred times. Go get your grandma on the phone. Get your grandma on the phone. You don't start watching watching your uncle and now you in the comments. Go get your grandma on the phone. It's either you or Orion. It's one of y'all. It's either you or Orion. Go get your grandma on the phone. You in here in the comments. Folks looking at the comments and you all over the place. Sher Sharika would never be. Ooh, let me not say that. God, I had to catch myself. I don't think that she'll be able to pull off a double based on the people that's in the hundred. <laughs> like, because I was about to say never. I don't ever say never, but based on the field that's in the hundred with her, growing with her, you gonna catch <laughs> hell trying to win that hundred. Two hundred dominant. I'll, I'll keep that. That hundred, 
that hook again. Let me talk to Maury Davis now. Like, what? Come on. You still got a better TT. TT. You still got a TT. You still got a better Julio Sue. You don't want to see it. You still got a uh, Oh, come on. No. <laughs> it's, too, it's too many. It's too many. It's too many. It's just, mm-mm. Mm, too many to say that. <laughs> two, 200. Right now, we're going to be in Vegas betting to see what time she rolling. No more betting to see if she's going to win. It's betting to see what time she's going to roll. No, that 9 5 coming down. Oh, that 9 5 coming down, Jack. They just don't know how to get to it yet. Watch this here. Everything I just taught y'all about. Shelly Ann, why she's running so fast, I want you to go back and look at a lot of your fastest sprinters and see what their arms are doing. And then I want you to go look at Shelly's arms and say, hmm, if their arms move like Shelly's arms, there you have it. That thing coming down. Matter of fact, go back and look at four arms when he went 9-5. Go, go look at it. <laughs> see, that boy was not, he went no, that boy was <laughs> it, was gone. <laughs> about? it was no plan. That dude got up and he was right here. Like I was there in live vision. <laughs> oh, no, no. Just go look. Go look. Trust me, when y'all get done with this show, just trust me on everything I'm saying right now. Go back and start looking at these races and just start. Don't look at the, the legs. Don't, Look at the arms. <laughs> and go look at the arms. Look at how rapid they be moving. Toboko. Toboko. Toboko going to be H-E double hockey sticks when he becomes a man. They ain't going to be able to beat him at all. Because he got it. Watch his arms. And he's so flimsy because like, he's still growing. He already right here with it. When he starts to grow and this this becomes this and he can really strike out, so he gone gone. Bye bye. <laughs> out of there. Out of there. Out of there. Yeah, exactly. It looked like he's jogging because he that relaxed and he turning over. Relaxation is the name of the game. When you when when you actually are running fast, it's just. Well, except for Shelly, because Shelly, like, like she moving, moving. You know, Bobby saying the same thing about Tobogo. Tobogo got like a, Tobogo got like a style of running that's so unrealistic because if you watch him, it's like, it's like watching paint dry. I'm just going to call it what it is. Like, watching him is just like watching paint dry because it's so boring. It's just, yeah, right. but then all of a sudden the clock be like 198. What? <laughs> what did I just watch? No, like yeah, that's the bobo. That's, that's the bobo. Hold on. Oh yeah, I got, I got, I got a mess with Wallace right now. <laughs> hey. Hey. I love that dude. I'm gonna tell y'all a quick story because I've been, you know. Uncle Ray right now, I've been drinking. I'm going to tell y'all a quick story. Wild and spirit. I love that dude in there. I love that dude in there. I've been kicking with Wild and Zerby X since 2005. <laughs> 2005. I remember Wild and Zerby X first got in the home. He drove to Kansas City. Came to the KU Relays. Ray, come on. I don't know. I told y'all the story when he was on the show. He came, picked me up in the goddamn old spaceship, and took off, and took me to the moon and back. In 30 seconds, I said, I hate you. That dude right there, I promise you, is probably one of the nicest people 
If you don't know him, he's probably one of the most nicest people you will ever meet. Wallace Spearman is and his father. They are so genuine, it's almost unreal how genuine they are and how genuine he is. Me and Wally got some stories, but one of the greatest ones was I remember Wally told me in 2009. It was going through all that relay nonsense, and then, you know, it was like, well, we don't think Ray will be on it. He don't even get around, yada, yada, yada. Wally came to me literally and said, hey, bro, I'm going to be honest with you. They can't even come out right in that relay, but I'm not going to do it. If they're not going to put you on it, I'm not going to run it. He literally came and told me straight up like that. He was like, nope, you worked for it. You earned it. You got third at the U USA 100. They, US, they is not going to do you like this. They come to me tomorrow and say, I, want to run. I say, nope, I'm not running the brand right now. I said, Wallace, do not do that. It's a true story. I said, Wallace, do not do that. I say, I appreciate you. From the bottom of my heart, I appreciate you for laying it out like that. But you go out there and do what you got to do on that relay. Don't worry about me. I'm going to do what I got to do in this honey, even though I got hurt. You go take care of that. I appreciate that gesture. That right there gained so much respect me for him. Because they really told me, he was like, I don't tell him, bro, if y'all not going to put radio on it, I'm not running. Y'all can't do him like that. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So shout out to my boy Wallace, man. That's my ninja, man. You know what I'm saying? For real. That's my dude right now. I love all these folks. Anyway, back to y'all. LP, what's going on, brother? Man, I had a call in today, man, LP, and you were even on the show, man. You were even there. Man, you got to wait next Wednesday, man. Janique and Shakuri made up. Of course. Y'all knew it was going to make up. Real love never dies, as they say, or whatever it is they call it. Shannon does believe she can go 10-4. Shelly believes she can go 10 for. Yeah, Jay, I already answered that, Jay. Yeah, I told you. I think she can break the world record in two years. So, yeah, we already, I already answered that. Calicio, what's going on, baby? What's going on, bro? Man, that, that's my brother right there. What's going on, man? I'm going to be off the show. I just came on here to answer the question, but y'all know how it is when Uncle Ray getting drinking and Talking to the family, and I supposed to be getting ready to go get out and dealing and all type of stuff, man. These folks gonna be mad at me. Y'all got me in here late. I told y'all I had already had like four shots before I even got on here. Claude Murphy, I agree with you. I agree with you, Claude. She has met her max. But Claude. 1060 is her max. She's did with devil with 61, which means her her end game is 57. That's her max out. That's her 57. Anything past 57, I'm gonna have to question. <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> I probably shouldn't have said that so early because if she do it, now I gotta come back to this show. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm saying, based on everything I'm looking at and all the signs and numbers, 57 of her end game, which is not a bad end game. 57 is not slow. <laughs> like, come on. 57? 57? <laughs> like, no, like, that's a cool end game. Like, they'd be like, your max out is 1057 on a video game. 1057. Yeah, I'll take her. <laughs> I'll take it down. Oh. 1053? See, here's the thing, K Love. I can see 1053 because I'm giving her max out at 57. So if her max out is at 57, you get the right condition, the right track, 53 can pop up. Give a 1.9, right? Everything she I would not be surprised if 53 popped up at all. 57 is her max. So 53, yeah. If that clock say for anything. We come back and do another show. <laughs> I'm going to tell you, man. If that clock ever say for anything about her name, we do another show. I'm going to be honest. I'm going to be honest. Yeah, we got another show for that. 
Cause we gonna have to get the bottom of that. We gonna get the bottom of that. Ten foot, ten fold. When I just said I don't see but one person walking this earth that has the capabilities and the body measurements to do that. We're gonna have to come back to the show and talk about that then. Can follow the reach, man. Can follow the reach. I definitely good for the three, though. Definitely good for the three. One thousand single for the three. Oh wow! Damn! Ooh wow! Somebody just asked a great question that I have no answer for. But I don't also know either. On my Twitter, somebody just said, why does you saying both do nothing in track and field now? Hmm. I could answer that this way. Why don't Maurice Green? Why don't my um, boy Pookie, Jeremy, Warren. It's a lot of great people. Like, Usain Bolt is just like super great with the records, but there's a lot of great people that don't do nothing in track and field. Nothing that's like out what you can see. You know, they might be coaching that like their daughter's school and stuff like that, but there's a lot of people who've done a lot of stuff who don't do that in track and field. <laughs> so, I don't think, I don't think, I think you're reading too much into it with that one. Like, Man, I got a reference. Y'all, what, what more do y'all want from me? <laughs> y'all still talking about me? You want to see me? Like, <laughs> y'all still here? <laughs> I, I go here nothing. Like, that's what the more they gonna talk about me. Right? He ain't gotta come back. He ain't gotta come back and do nothing. But, uh, I think, like, I think the status that both has in track and field, you can't. Come back in it. Like you're above the sport. Like you are literally above the sport. You coming back and doing anything in the sport is you're to to me personally, to me, man, you 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 yeah, that's you stepping down. If I'm both like, bro, do what? Come back and do what? Come, come. What's the host a show? What what I look like hosting a show? What? <laughs> like, hey, if I'm both, what? Do you know who? I'm gone. <laughs> I'm gone. Better watch my, watch my, my, my new album about to come out. <laughs> yeah, I'm done with track, man. I ain't got nothing to do with that. Mm -mm. Ain't nothing to do with that. As far as you know, I'm the, I'm the word. I'm, I'm both. If anything, I'm gonna be like, he looks good. Does it not? <laughs> That's all he's doing. That person looks good. That's enough. That's enough. You can't do nothing else. I got both blessing. That's enough. <laughs> I mean, else. We got 10 minutes, and then I really do got to go. I got to go because I know these folks are waiting on me. But the folks that wait on me, watching the damn show. So, well, y'all, yeah. <laughs> I'll be there. Appreciate you. Mm -hmm. I'm not hungry yet, so that's why I haven't left yet. But as you also can see, I'm saving money. So when I get there, I ain't got to spend no money on no drinks because I'm be there. I'm going to get there already. I have my drinks. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and Gabby in, in, in Boma. You know what's going to be interesting? That's going to be interesting. That's going to be real interesting. When Mboma come back. Now you got to also ask the question, though. If Mboma hadn't got hurt, would Sharif would be queen of the 200? You got to throw it out there. You got to put it out there. You know, like, Way M Bumble runs that curve in that straight, and the way she was looking last year ain't going to this year. If M Bumble hadn't got hurt, damn rock. <laughs> hey, 
Hey, Jan Rock, that's all I'm saying. If she hadn't got hurt, y'all might would have been in trouble, trouble, trouble. <laughs> Because <laughs> in Bowl and World Champs, you think she's going to catch that? You think she's going to catch that on the curve? She's going to look. Y'all know. Y'all know. I rock right with y'all now, but look at me. Look at me. Look. <laughs> in that same race, I'm going to tell you what would have happened. Mboma probably would have broke the world record because you were not denying Sharika that 21-4. You was not denying her of that. You was not. She's going to give you that. But let's not pretend like Mboma is just some punk. <laughs> like, Mboma on hook now and tell me what happened. Mboma goes 21-3 now because Sharika went 21-4. I'm not saying she's going to go no slower. I'm saying in Boma still going to be. I'm like, I'm in Boma. That just means I'm going to put my three. I'm saying. I, I knew y'all was going to start talking. I knew y'all was going to start saying something. I knew y'all was going to start saying something. Yeah, she would have. I think she would have for sure. At World Champs this year, I'm talking about not last year. I'm not looking at no, no, no. I'm talking about this year. The emboma, if the emboma we saw who started out had a stayed on her training path and not got hurt, you can't sit here and pretend like she wouldn't be ready to go 21 4. And what you can't pretend like she wouldn't gonna be ready to do the same thing Shrika just did. Can you? Yeah, I'm saying that. I'm saying she would have brought the world record because you're not denying Sharika of that 21 4. That 21 4 is still gonna happen. But what I'm saying, a healthy, a healthy, strong, fast in Boma, that means Sharika just made her go 21-3. That's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. I ain't saying I'm not taking that from Sharika. I'm just saying that Boma was, come on now, let's not pretend. <laughs> See, let's not pretend. Now. Come on, let's not do that. In the good race. I don't know about 21 2 and 21 3. That's reaching. But I do think 21 3, 21 4. I do think that for sure. I think, do think 21 3, 21 4. I, I think you're reaching with the 21 2 now because 21 2 fast. But then again, then again, 21 2, 21. What I want to stay with, 21 1? Yeah, I can see it. 21 2. Yes. Damn. Nah. I'm going back. Journey. What is that? Journey with Colleen. Hey, we I know y'all ain't I know y'all ain't scared. That, I, that's the one thing I know Jerry Rock ain't. Jerry Rock, I ain't gonna never say y'all scared of no what y'all say, blood clot. Oh, y'all ain't scared of nobody. I know this to be factual, but that don't mean you can't get your ass whooped. <laughs> hey. You tough guys don't took the loss. <laughs> I know y'all love y'all for that. But I think if them bone was right, man, then bone might would have. No, oh, man. Yeah. Just saying, man. Just saying. Just saying. Just Twenty twenty one with a boat, U.S. clean sweep, one hundred two hundred meter. A healthy, the grass would have broke the sweep. Yeah, hell yeah. What? What? Huh? What are you? What are you saying? Why would you not? Yes. <laughs> yes. Yes. That's what I said. Yes. Yes. Yeah. He would have broke the sweep. One or the other. Come on. Why would you think not? Like at some point in time, like we always say. Man, you gotta look at these four resumes. What is he doing when he's healthy? All right, well, see, when he's healthy, he know how to get on the podium. I'm not gonna say he's not breaking that thing up. I'm saying somebody getting left out. Who knows at that point? But a healthy DeGrasse, a healthy DeGrasse is not missing that podium. And not this year? This year in Oregon? This, this, bro, no. 
<laughs> no. If he was healthy, that dude getting a medal. How many times have he shown y'all that? Like, bro, if I'm healthy, I'm getting a medal. <laughs> I don't even question it. I don't know where I'm at, but I promise you, I'm on the podium. <laughs> so anybody that that's like saying against LeBron going to the playoffs, like, okay, well, LeBron them kind of weak, but outside of that, no, LeBron's gonna be in the playoffs. That's the grass. The, the grass will be on the podium. I'm not gonna bet against that. If he's healthy, <laughs> hey, hey, oh yeah. That was easy. Easy. I don't know why you would think this thing other than this. <laughs> yeah. Y'all not see this. Boy, that boy is the truth. He's been the truth since USC. He ain't never not been the truth. The grass ain't never not made podiums unless he hurt. Man, no, I'm not betting against that. Mm -mm. Yeah, no. Mm -mm. Nope. Not doing it. Even when Vote was running. It do still get on the podium. Man, I'm not, man, come on. Y'all better, re better recognize who the grass is for real. What? That's why when somebody was talking about some respect to no, no respect to Noah, but they were like, man, they should have put Noah on anger. For what? <laughs> that is still under the grass. And what are you saying? Like, what? Oh, wow. Man, all right. <laughs> all right. I don't understand why y'all be asking questions about that Canadian. That dude done showed y'all. I'm crip blood. <laughs> My God. Running's fine. Running's starting to, you know, I told y'all he was, last time I talked to him, he was, you know, just building his off the track stuff. Later, last thing I heard, he was hurt, but then got over it. But when he got over it, it was just better to just, you know, wait till next year. He got his money though. So who the hell cares? I mean, I mean like that. I mean like that, but I'm like, Larry got his money. Okay, sit down the first year. I'm straight. Literally. Don't rush back. You got a small sit down. You sit down. Sit down. He ain't gonna do nothing. Man, I did the same thing. Yeah, man, I'm straight, bro. It's pretty year of my contract, man. Let me get myself together. I'll see y'all next year. Yeah, boy, you weren't supposed to. Yeah. Pull me another drink. Yeah, with them. Yeah, with them. Spill the beans. After this one, y'all, I'm done. By cutting my bottles down, first of all. Shout out to, um, hey, get screwed. And then I gotta go. I gotta go. I don't say it that like 20 times. By the time I get there, whatever. Um, uh, yep, Lil Lil Man, exactly. Give your boy a year off and keep the train niggas the same. He ain't. The thing about Larry not running, he ain't to a nail muscle fiber. That car is ready. <laughs> I'm talking about that car gonna come out next year. Like it's time. Man. Next year gonna be interesting. Next year gonna be hella interesting. MJ, MJ caught a prank. She's fine though. Matter of fact, let me text my sister. I mean, I heard her and texted with oh no, they sleep over there. Um. Hmm. Oh, okay. Um. I'm about to say. Um. Yeah, MJ fine. MJ is fine. MJ is fine. She caught a little cramp when she was doing a warm up, and then you know. At the end of the day, like, y'all saw the show. Like, I told her, I was like, sis, like, this is your vacation. Like, don't even put no stress on none of that. Don't even, that, nothing. Like, go have fun. And that's what she did. And then in her warm-up, she felt something. And then her coach is like, shut it down. <laughs> All right. Season over with. Bravo. <laughs> like, you come. Bravo. Shut it down. So, AJT, Ray, who win the Diamond League final men's 100 meter dash? 
AJ. Ooh, AJ T. That's a good damn question because I don't know. <laughs> I have no idea. I have the slightest idea. I have the slightest idea. I can tell you who is between. Do that for sure. In between. Bracing, bro, man. Which one gonna take it? Bro, I have no idea. I ain't even gonna lie to you. This is gonna be the first time that I'm gonna sit there like y'all, like, I don't know who gonna win. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Because that's the only two that's happened. That's the only two. So, you know. I don't know. I have no idea. I have no idea. No idea. All time US me and four by one who I got. <sighs> That's a hard do you gotta think on that for like two days, bro. There's so many people that did such great. I mean, I can go back to Kobe Miller on first leg. Like it, that's a loaded man. I don't know. I really don't know because this it's so many of us. And I'm saying us because like, bro, you better go watch my relay fan. Like, I'm no joke on the back stretch or on ankle leg. But anyway. It's just so many of us, the combinations got to be right. Gosh, each like it's wow. You you can never go wrong with put it this way. I ask that question this right here. You can never go wrong with any top four at any world championship from America from any year and putting them together. You can never go wrong. You just gotta make a stick get around. Simple as that. You can you can never go wrong. Never ever go wrong. Because USA ain't gonna have the four fastest. If you got the four fastest, shit, it don't matter. You can take you can take first place from 2003 and put third place in 2006 and put second place in 2008 and put got on second place in 2010 together. <laughs> like it don't matter. Whatever four you put together, if it's a top three in America, whatever four from whatever year you put together should go 36 one. Don't matter because they all gonna be nine, nine, ten old runners or oh, ten or oh, nine, seven runners. We can get one or two of them. See, fire hard. That's what I'm saying. Like, it's a lot of people who ain't fast but good. Like, if you ask me, Kobe Miller won the best curve runners, but then most people gonna go with you know my boy T. Reason. But I'm like, shit, I want to put T. Reason. And got them first. He got the worst start. But then he also got the best curve out of the front of the 200. So it's like, <laughs> this is too many. It's way too, it's way too many. I be done putting Marty Scales over there first. A lot of folks don't even know who, who Marty Scales is. But I'm like, bro, I put my money on Marty Scales against a lot of people. Trail Collins, I mean, uh, Trail Cannons, my boy. I don't know man. man, it's too many. It's way too many. <laughs> way too again. That man is when you go to my that America relay, bro. That's too many folks that you can put in too many places to my what's the top for the best four ever. Too many. Dennis Mitchell. I mean, come on, bro. JD. We talking about American relays. Leroy Burrell. Like, there is no what's the best four. It's bro, pick any four. Just make them do stick work. <laughs> like, damn, it don't matter. All time U.S. women for about 100. Shit, the one that got the record. That's an easy one. <laughs> what you talking about? That was the best. You're not going to see that no time. Well, the new girls might hit that. But that one, that one, do y'all need to go watch that again and see how magical that one was? When Tiana took her first step, you said, oh, shit. <laughs> like, and when Addison got it, you said, oh, my God. And then when Bianca got that thing, you said, damn, that's Bianca night. And then soon it touched Carmelita hand, you was like, I'm not even gonna watch the rest of it. This is this is rated R. Turn this off. <laughs> see, like, uh, that right there, that four, best ever. You can't put no other four. You can go take any other four and put that four together, and they cannot beat that four. Not happening. Not happening. Not happening. Not happening. Those girls. It was like they went from 
super fast to even super, super, super fast to even faster than Carmelita got that thing and it was like, oh man, that shit gone. You knew at, you literally knew at 80 meters out, that record was gone. <laughs> like, you're like, mm-mm, mm-mm, mm-mm. <laughs> when Carmelita got, when Carmelita got 20 meters in, you knew, oh, that bit gone, bro. So it dropped that line. It's over with. It's over with. And so she looked at it. Oh, like I told y'all, <laughs> go. Man, that was a beautiful four by one. When I talk, when I'm saying beautiful, if you want, if any coaches is watching, if you want to show a perfect four by one, go show that women's four by one American record four by one. Man, that thing that was so beautiful, like the speed, the sticks, the movements, like it with no bobbles. It was just. Go. Go. Man, blood stop. But again, to break a record, that's what you're going to have to have. You got to have that. You got to have that. You know, to break a record. And then you had Allison Felix on the back stretch. Allison ain't never win no 10 6, no 7, no 8. No. No. It's all about that. Go. Because that, even though she was a 10 9 level no runner, that just became a 10 6. All in that stick. That's all it is. Allison will high step it though. Like Allison, that, that was a different Allison. I don't know who she channeled, but that when she was her front side, mechanics was like, you just left the genome working your hip flexors. Them thing was like a blood drum major, and like she went to Tuskegee University. I said, ooh, whoa, I'm trying to tell y'all, man, that, why is that thing again? Hmm. Michael Blunt. You can't say that, Michael Blunt. You can't say that because the man got medals. Y'all expectations sometimes be a little too high. He got medals. Trayvon only had one bad year. That was last year. In Tokyo. This year wasn't a bad year. This year wasn't a bad year at all. He got a medal at the World Championships. He be all right. He got a hard work. As long as you get a hard work, nothing you can say about nobody. You, you you can be like, well, you should have got one. You should have won. Well, he didn't. <laughs> it didn't matter. He got hard well. You run a race again, the medals might switch up. That's all we want. We don't give a damn where you playing that. You just better land on that podium. <laughs> yeah. That's it. Your, your career is measured by you better land on that damn podium. We don't care what place you land in. First, second, third, but you better touch it. <laughs> you ain't touch. Leave him alone. Leave him alone. <laughs> yeah, leave him alone. That's what I'm about the world record. But we'll be trying to tell y'all time don't mean nothing. Don't mean nothing. I mean, shit, you better work record, whatever you don't do better, don't mean nothing. And shit, the year I ran 995, I ain't even made the damn team. Time don't mean nothing. Shit. Better go out there and get on that podium. Oh, yeah, Martin was a real deal, man. Look here, y'all. I'm trying to tell y'all, man. See, he know. See, Cody who said that. Coach, Coach Dillon know, man. Y'all don't understand. Scales? Martin Scales? On first end? Man, y'all better come on. Look here. I'm going to tell y'all right here, right now. This is why we didn't. This is why in 2005, the World Championships 2005, the reason why the Team USA didn't get that stick was because they pulled me off the second leg like idiots. Me and Martin Scales trained together in Kansas City. He was my training partner. Do you know what me and Martin Scales actually did at practice? Stick work. Because we were like, bro, everywhere we go, Martin was the one that actually put me on. And Martin's like, oh, we're going to start with the stick work at practice. And then when we go, 
We're gonna be one two, one two late. What man, me and Marty was the nastiest combo you gonna see. Me and me and Marty had silent handoffs, like hot bot. <laughs> 2005, 10 USA took me off the second leg, which they should never done, and put Linda Scott over there. Shout out to my boy Linda, he's still cold. And but and Marty and Linda dropped the stick. Y'all know if you start if you old head like me, 2005, they brought a stick. At the same year that me and Marty have been running relays all year long together in every relay camp. And you took me off the morning of the relay. Me and Marty had been working our, me and Marty were going to practice and just be like, Ray, let's go get a shot away. We would do like three of them at the World Championships. It's like three, because we've been in house. We can't sit the whole time together. They took me off the morning of. Think hits the ground. Stupid. How would you, why would you do that? <laughs> like, why? That's why I tell you to say, anyway, you know, like, that's the dumbest shit you could ever do. Literally, like, I'm here at the World Chess because I finished fifth at USA. Come on now, Jack. You know what I'm saying? And Marty finished behind me. I get it, but why would you do? All right, well, hey. Click, 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 click. <laughs> it is what it is. It is what it is. Huh? Oh. That's it. That's a sign. That's a sign I told y'all when I finished that. It's time to go. Got to call my Uber. Hold on. Bang. Let me hit it now. Let me forward my Uber. <laughs> I'm sorry, y'all. I'm I'm still laughing at Wallace. That boy is that boy is that. I'm be honest with y'all. I'm just an extrovert, be honest. But I promise y'all, people like Tyson Wallace, like all these people that y'all don't really see, and they just be like back in the back. Them folks are hilarious. I'm telling y'all, them folks are hilarious. They just don't do like this. Like come on, show but. They not dry. Or y'all be like, they just dry. No, trust me, Jack. Them folks is. <laughs> but anyway. Am I good at Am I going? Oh, yeah. Hold on, y'all. I got to call my Uber. Mm -hmm. okay. I got 12 minutes. All right, y'all. Um, No, I don't think Melissa's going 10 7 5 next year. I think Melissa's going 10 6 next year. For sure. For sure. AJ, I appreciate that. You know, Reason, my boy. And they ever let me and Reason do something like that, boy, they're going to have to put us in Hollywood. <laughs> I'm mean, a whole lot of yelling on that show. A whole lot of yelling. Uh, Basically, I got to say this live because there's a lot that was said. Uh, it's on my YouTube channel anyway, so it's always saved. It's on my YouTube channel. Uh, what the hell are you talking about? Captain about what? You see how my voice got high? I thought I got 20 minutes for my Uber call. I got two minutes for you. Captain about what? No, she's going 10 6 next year. She's going 10 6. She's going 10 6. She already went. To, see, I don't, I, if y'all, I, I don't know. I ain't talking to y'all nothing. She's already went 10 6. She's already went 10 6. It was windy. Okay. But what have we always told y'all about once your body goes there? Even Dominique came over here. He's a former world record holder and said the same thing. Once your body goes there, it can go back. You just got to get them. She's already ran 10 6. It ain't out of the realm of possibility. <laughs> like, her body has went from zero to 110.6 seconds. It was wind assisted. So, guess what? Now you have to do, you have to build your body up to do that. It is what it is. It what it is. It's funny because all of the smart people on this side that be like, no, if your body go that wind data, you can go back. You can. I challenge y'all to do this right here. I challenge y'all to go look at all y'all fast people, look at all y'all world records, and see 
what they did Wendy first. Go ahead. Go look at it. Go look at it. Go look at it. Go look at it. Even, even, even T. Reason. Even both. Go look at what they did Wendy first. And then look at what they came back and did. If your body goes there, it can go there again. You just got to figure out how to make it go there. Y'all, y'all missing the point of see. Here's the thing that's wrong with y'all. Don't make me start calling y'all stupids again, cause y'all have learned a lot of stuff, and y'all ain't been saying stupid stuff lately. So, don't make me go ahead and call y'all stupid, okay? Y'all stupids. T.T. Terry, yeah, she went there, but that don't mean you finna go back there instantly. That don't mean the same season. Ain't no, that means literally. If your body has went there, it can go back. It might not be the same season. It might not be the next season. It might be the season after that. But if you went there, you can go back. Y'all are sitting there thinking, oh, you got like next week, got to do it again. No, bro, it was wind dated. But give it time. The body cannot grow to that point. What wind dated time show you is what your body is actually capable of doing if you actually strengthen it the proper way. That's all that is. See it. When they the times, why would I be arguing with y'all? But anyway, like I always say, I should probably start keeping a tally. I should probably start keeping a tally of how many I told you so. Oh, I do keep a tally. It's called my Twitter. You should probably just go search race tape. I told you so. Do that. <laughs> do, do, do that. Just Raise take, I told you so. And see how many times I don't say it, I told you so. I only say I told you so on stuff that y'all believe can't happen. And I'll be like, I told you so. Kind of like the USA women winning the four by 100 meter dash that nobody thought would happen. I was like, no, but that shit can happen. And then what happened? I told you so. <laughs> Stop playing with me. What camera? Stop playing with me. I keep trying to tell y'all. Stop playing with me. Stop playing with me. Told you so. Don't become another I told you so. Don't become another I told you so. LB, first of all, LB, let me see about you, LB. LB, you on punishment. I'm, a, I'm announcing it right now. Boy, LB, brother. LB, this is why you on punishment, LB. Before I get off this show. LB, you on punishment because you came on here during the summertime and we're talking about Christy Cole. Right, you can't talk about Chris Gorman. Chris Gorman gonna make the championship. He gonna get a medal. He gonna be on top of it. I say LB. No, he's not. I say LB. Respectfully, I love Chris Gorman, but it's not gonna happen. It's not gonna happen for him. Yes, it is. You gonna respect Chris Gorman? He gonna be on it. All right, LB. All right, cool. Hey, look. <laughs> El, I told you. You know how he must have not been training. <laughs> El, said he must have not been training. You think? No, he, he was training. It takes time. <laughs> I told you, I was like, not this year. he been out two years. Let him get him, let him get his feet wet again. LB, LB was just stuck on it like, nope. I said, all right, bro. All right, you and Anson going to see it the hard way. <laughs> you and Anson and Coach going to see it the hard way come, come June. <laughs> I told you so. Stop playing with me. I'm going to go. <laughs> Let go. Bye. <laughs>